Welcome back to my channel everyone, Jason here reviewing the 2018 Bubba Wallace Click and Close Chevrolet Camaro Z01 124 scale Elite Color Chrome by Lana Racing and if you're a normal subscriber and see my reviews I go over the box first so let's take a look at it. It is your standard 2018 Elite packaging very similar to your 2017 Elite boxes except for the one major difference which I'll point out but on the front here we have the Chrome Elite logo Got the NASCAR hologram up there on the top left. Lionel Racing, the official diecast of NASCAR, and 124 scale stock car limited edition adult collectible. Moving on to the other side, exactly the same basically as the top, just minus any branding from Lionel Racing. In the box here features 2018, the RCCA Elite logo, barcode, and the production sticker, which says Darrell Walsh Jr., number 43, click and close. 2018 Camaro Elite Color Chrome, one of only 24 produced. Mine is DIN number 22. Move on to the side here, and here's the major difference on the 2018 Elite boxes. It just goes over the differences that you can expect in a 2018 Elite. And this end of the box features some licensing. Moving on to the generic Elite 2018 Certificate of Authenticity. Here it is. Pause the video if you'd like to read it. Totally different than last year and past uh, certificates always had a description of the car and handwritten uh, production number. Not no more. And there's the back. Completely blank. Alright, moving on to the die cast itself. And it is a, it's a looker. That chrome, color chrome purple really stands out on this particular Z01. So let's go ahead and start off on the front of the car. Hopefully you guys can see here. We do have the 43 right there on the right side. The Chevy bow tie on the middle of the headlight detailing. Z01 on the lower grille and Richard Petty Motorsports. Of course up here on the hood we do have click and close mortgages and Monster Energy and the Chevy bow ties up here on the windshield banner. Go ahead and open up the hood. You don't have too much in there for engine detail, what you'd expect. But we do have Wix, click, click and close, and the Chevrolet bow tie on the inside of the hood. Go ahead and look at the uh, side here. Actually, we'll point that way so you can see it better. Down here for contingencies, we have Moog, Molly, Comp Cam, Edelbrock, and Sunoco. Along with Goodyear above both front fenders. We do have the detailing down there on the uh, wheel where it has the aero race wheel decal and painted yellow lug nuts. Up there on the A post, we do have NASCAR race car. We have the Monster Energy NASCAR Cup Series logo, Mechanic Wear, 3M Flowmaster, and the NASCAR Sunoco Rookie of the Year Contender logo. We have, of course, the number 43 and Pioneer. Up on the B post, we have Coca Cola, Mac Tools, another little sponsor, along with Monster Energy. Up on the roof row, we have Bubba Wallace and the American flag, and it does have a little side mirror right there. Full window net closure now from the Roll bar all the way to the B post, as you can see. Also up there on the roof, you can see we have two little antennas, one there and one right there, along with the bubble cam. Roof flaps do uh, fully deploy. I'm only going to open the one because the other one's a little bit tricky. We do have the number 43 and clickandclose.com on the roof. Once again, I really hope this color chrome shows up on camera. Back here on the C post, we have safety clean. On the quarter panel, we have the American Ethanol Fuel Filler, U.S. Air Force, STP, and Click and Close. Go ahead and move to the rear TV panel. We have ClickandClose.com, Chevrolet bow tie. There is a TV camera right there next to the Chevy bow tie. Osco Z01 Camaro, got the rookie stripes and the number 43. It does have Wallace here on the back window and your DIN number of 22. We have Eckrich since 1894 on the deck lid. And, of course, the familiar small spoiler. Go ahead and pop open the uh, deck lid. Still has the, it's hard to see, but still has the red fuel cell, which you'd expect. No detail has been changed on the fuel cell. Right side of the car is basically the same, except for the little exhaust tip sticking out of the rocker panel down there. And, of course, the detail of the little X and day glow orange parts where the rescue workers or officials can push and pull out the uh, passenger side window. It's a really nice looking die cast. Uh, if you're a Bubba Walsh fan, uh, I'd highly recommend picking up any of his die casts this year. 
The color, this car may still be in stock from Lionel Racing. It is a RCCA member exclusive, I believe. I uh, have been a member of the RCCA since 2012. So, yeah, it has its benefits, more or less, less benefits now, but there's still benefits involved. Go ahead and look at the bottom. There's the bottom of it. It does have your DIN number printed on the bottom of the fuel cell container right there, which is 0022, of course. We do have the RCCA Elite logo printed onto the chassis there. Lionel Racing branding. Of course, you can see no uh, plastic uh, bits on the bottom. You still have all the detail underneath. You got the truck arms right here. You got the blue uh, springs, full rear end housing. Drive shaft is co fully contained in this bit here. Got the exhaust and everything, headers coming off the engine. Got the transmission and linkages down here. Full working steering, transmission detailing, got the bottom end of the motor down there. So yeah, it's fully detailed as you'd expect uh, anyways on the car. So yeah, that is my review of the 2018 Bubba Walsh number 43 Click and Close Mortgages ZL1 Color Chrome Elite by Lionel Racing. If you enjoyed this review, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you have yet to subscribe. I post new diecast reviews every Monday and or Tuesday, along with short diecast showcases throughout the week. Click that bell for notifications so you don't miss out on any future videos, and be sure to follow me on social media at JasonAStrange69. That is absolutely everywhere, Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram. So thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this review. Tune in next week for an all-new diecast review. Have a great night, take care, and see you next week. Bye.